Oh, the humans. Okay. This could be this could be okay. Hopefully he's got an apple and like one skill. Apple one skill. No, it is dodge though. Only eleven men. Okay. Got a win in a draw. Mighty mighty blow with claw. <laughs> Yeah, it's it's winnable. It's winnable. I think mean, humans are pretty decent. I mean, they're a way better than Chaos at, at a thousand TV, but it's winnable, isn't it? They're not broken like lizard men or you know horrific like orcs or dwarves. It's definitely winnable. Hello, BB Snot. Fifty nine minutes. I like I like his average play time. That's brilliant. <laughs> oh man, the orc to you either. That's terrible. <laughs> wow. I'm very sad about the uh, the old cheerleader. It's not the um, <laughs> it's on the Discord, which you can uh, which you can which you can go on if you're not already on. But there's the new there's the new old cheerleader. Um, there's the Discord. Yeah. Um, What the hell? Do I try and get a Kaz with him? I've touched down with him and then another one. Yeah, what is that? It looks like a fucking orc housewife. It doesn't look like a cheerleader, does it? Looks like a orc granny that's about to fucking should have some kind of kitchen utensil in its hand. Yeah, why are they wearing clothes? Just like fucking orcs are Arabs. <laughs> <laughs> That's a gross generalization, but you know what I mean. Those those countries where they're uh, where the women have got to wear like loads of clothes and shit. That's like maybe that's what orcs are like. Even though orcs are like fully half naked all the time. <laughs> um, do I carry with a warrior, and do I score with a warrior? Or do I? Uh, Scoring warrior's got to be good, but it's, is it a is it a rookie one or is it the gun five to get to eight and get block? I think getting more in MVP range is better. I would like the orc cheerleader to look more like a cheerleader than an orc housewife. Yeah, they should have done, yeah. I want to look like a cheerleader. Like, okay, orcs aren't ever going to be sexy, but they could try to be sexy, couldn't they? <laughs> Just for realism of it being like, you know, a sports-ish simulator-ish thing. Like, punch things. In the Dudley Death Drop. Oh, baby. <laughs> Is that all too nice, this lad? 
Oh my god. Another three dice block. What is this? What is this sorcery? And another one. Two D before picking up the ball. Two removals, two. What I didn't even notice. But yeah, two removals turn one, that's pretty good, isn't it? I honestly didn't even notice that, holy shit. Let me just go for the pickup, he's in not a bad spot. Oh, baby. Now I don't need to re-roll it when I, when it fails, if it fails. If I like that, because otherwise you could have run around the side a little bit, couldn't you? Wow, what a what a, what a perfect start! <laughs> screened off, everything screened. Two removals. It doesn't get much better than that, does it? Ball picked up. Holy shit! The elf cheerleaders. That's kind of that's kind of what you'd expect when they're like more like wood elf cheerleaders, aren't they? From the looks of it, that's better. And then chaos ones, pretty cool. I like the chaos ones actually with the little horns. <laughs> yeah, the chaos ones are pretty good. Oh yeah, the Elven Union like the old like the old cheerleaders. Yeah, they're really good. They're all really good, but the fucking orc one. Terrible. But yeah, the orc head on that head on all of the orcs would be amazing. Fucking muscly orc woman, isn't it? Holy shit. Oh why? <laughs> so I make two KOs and then he double skulls with his uh with his fucking thing. It's too good. It's too good. Nothing's getting better than this. I should just stop playing for the rest of the day. It doesn't get better than that. Still want enough so that I can come back here. I probably don't want to come back though, seeing as his ogre's isolated. Could go for the hit there and more hits, couldn't I? That seems wise. Also, he's on five, so if he gets the Kaz, he levels. of angry housewives yeah oh yeah that, that one, the one in the middle looks better this has got a bit of leg showing or are they pants so yeah angry housewives but that could make that could make for a good blood ball team holy shit holy shit they'd just be a good blood ball team to be fair don't even use them as cheerleaders just use them as a fucking bl normal blood ball team Thanks for the pictures, Van. Have you, have you got a bunch of them?
No, I tweeted it from Warhammer Fest. Oh, okay. No law, no BB snow. No, 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 no. Now, 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 now. Law wise, they would be sexy orc cheerleader girls. Because Warhammer is not Blood Bowl. So there you go. You could go there. And he could go one, two, three, blitz him into there and get another more hits. But it would mean giving up this hit potentially. Could also just put him in there. One, two, three, four, five. That does the same thing, doesn't it? Perfect. Oh, in fact, he could just do it. Right. No need to overcomplicate anything. Yeah, or 40k are definitely mushrooms. And then I think they kind of, they retconned, they retconned uh, Warhammer to also be mushrooms. But that's not Blood Bowl. So there you go. Twice. He's double skulled and born at it twice, this fucking ogre. Holy shit. Nah, I was just gonna run away from it. Um, which has turned out pretty good so far, seeing as he's just been stupid. And when he finally does stand up, he's just gonna be stuck on a shitty beastman. Oh, I could maybe uh, go diagonally now. One, two, three, four, five. Don't have a lot of movement, though, that's the problem. to stop that pretty much. I'm just going to man's in with some strength four here seeing as I'm uh, seeing as I've got the two man advantage kind of semi three man advantage of this guy and this guy. Translate all of the things. Panzer man, tank man. <laughs> but head splitter is that, that translate as worst ogre ever. I don't know what you do as a human team here. Uh, I feel bad for using humans. Probably um, would be my advice. But yeah, just try and get in the way and try to get in the way and hope things work out. Get behind him is okay there, isn't it? Because seeing as this guy's a bit fucked now anyway. Maybe he should have been there. I mean, now I'm moving five, so he can get in the way a bit here. He's literally rolled five ones in a row, double skull into three boneheads. 
Wow, ey. <risa> wow, ey. <risa> well, here we have put is the name. This guy is about to roll five fucking ones in a row. <risa> <laughs> the bad thing about the warrior carrier is that I don't get a warrior fucking punching things, do I? You have to do some one D's here. Oop. Oop. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, oh, glorious. Knew I could count on a gym pal there. <laughs> glorious. Pretty unlucky, yeah, he's been he's been horrifically unlucky, yeah. No doubt about it. Holy shit. <laughs> this is nuts. <laughs> This is just fucking nuts. Holy shit. Alright. How unlucky can you get? One in eighty one. Actually, pretty unlucky because now it gives him a one dice to uphill the ball. But never mind. Mm -hmm. He has been more unlucky for sure. But still, only KOs. So he's still looking at 11 second half. Good chance of 11 second half. So, as ridiculously one sided as this, as this half has been. Um, if you want to be part of Team Positive, then uh, you've got to fucking suck it up and uh -oh. stop bitching like a little baby and try and fucking play better, eh? He hasn't, he hasn't lost the game in the first half. Obviously, he's, he's lost this drive pretty hard. <laughs> he's obviously lost this drive pretty hard. Um, but it's not as if he's absolutely lost the game 100%, you know, which, like... With these dice, he could have done if he'd been on defence or whatever. On offense, if he'd been on offense and he'd had this much of a dicing, I guess he would have just lost already. All right, ball down here isn't as bad. I don't want to use a reroll, so there you go. Three dice blitz. Oh man. Thank God it's only a KO. No, it's not a skill up. No, I went with a rookie one in an effort to get people within like. MVP or Kaz range rather than uh, rather than trying to level one. Now whether that's the right or wrong idea, 
I don't know. Away from me, Olga bastard. I can go one, two, three, four, five, GFI, GFI. to the old guy. Yeah, probably one in 81. Which, it, it wasn't so bad, but it could have been. It could have been bad. If he'd got the pal, which was 50-50, um, it would have given him kind of an easy way to Maybe he's one or half dice the ball, but I mean, it wasn't that bad, was it? Moving 10 got her after four matches, holy shit. That's the thing, it's not even hard to get, is it? That's the thing about moving 10 got is they're not even hard to get. Absolutely disgusting. Not bad. I'm, I'm, I like that he's got. Um, I like that he's got a nice speed of game. <laughs> it's the most important thing. Oh yeah, it is awesome. I know it's awesome. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's completely awesome. But the disgusting thing is, it's not even hard to get. <laughs> He can go for the bliss to try and get a level. Normally I'd hit him for the armor 7, but of course, Cyanide playing by their own rules. Brachiosaurus with a flamethrower. <laughs> One guy stays out, two out of three come back. Okay. Now, I wouldn't have broken armor seven anyway, no, that's true. I did check. But still, it would have been better, wouldn't it? You could actually, he could have actually outbashed me this half. He's got the LOS hits, and then we've both got a KO. Like it's, it's crazy, isn't it? As, as brutal as that half was, one-sided. I'd expect to score my drive anyway against anybody, you know, with like reasonable luck. With reasonable, I mean, even with chaos against fucking Wood Elves against Spartaco, I would have scored. Uh, like I had, I had a chance to score. Half the time I would have scored, ish, on my drive, even after getting outbashed to fucking death. So, I think I would back myself to score against most people. Yeah, you easily can tell. Yeah, as ridiculous as that half was, complete insane dice. And yet, I didn't get cars, did I? So, without getting cars. It's, and it was on my drive. If it had been on his drive and he got those dice, holy shit, five ones in a row. And uh, and all the removals. And obviously it made my drive easy. You know, it made my drive an auto score. Um, but still, 
I still think I would have scored even if uh, even you know barring crazy bad luck. You might get the one turn. You never know. Movement eight. It's not. It's not crazy. Probably should have passed it first. Seeing as he's a shitty human. Should have passed it when he was in one tackle zone. And it did start him in start with the whole method. He shouldn't have used the whole method. He should not have used the whole method. And uh he should have passed him in one tackle zone probably. He could have put the catcher here. Passed it to him. Blitzed in there, pushed him up to here. That's what he should have done. So he's done it wrong. Even if even if he scores, he's done it. He's done it suboptimally. This is only two. Yeah, he needs another push. He's got three pushes here, hasn't he so far? Lucky, lucky Dino. Don't haunt machine, that's definitely one for the list to do, for sure. Um, that's one on the to-do list. I've, I've, I haven't been making the YouTube... I said I was going to make the get up early and make YouTube videos, but then I decided to fucking go for 12-hour streams, which uh, which basically made that and not not happen. But um, he should have done the pass first, shouldn't he? The pass here would have been... Oh, he's going to do this pass and the handoff. Fair enough, that actually works, doesn't it? That actually works pretty well. Doing the pass and the handoff might actually be better than if done the catch in the, in the tackle zone. I'm not sure. He's got skill rerolls here and skill rerolls for the Dodgers, hasn't he? Don't hate it. Makes it harder for no reason. Because he's gone down the side. Good. Um, I did a I did a movement seven one turner, um, which is on YouTube. Um, so I could find that for you. An actual one. Sage, Sage has got a video where the title is Movement 7 One Turn, but um, it's not actually. A, a, it's not a one turn, and B, he's not Movement 7. <laughs> so it was uh, it was quite an epic fail from Sage in that video. You know, we're still friends, but I can, uh, I can point that out, can't I? Why have I got a guy on the bench here? Oh, because, yeah, he was KO'd, right. I like this setup when when the team is shit. Because it's weakest at the sides and through the middle, isn't it? So you got strength four there and there. Glorious. Jim is back to Blood Bowl after messing with other games for China. <laughs> Thank you very much, cool dude. Thanks for staying. Fantastic. Glorious. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you got the, these are the weak points, aren't they? So it makes it hard to, to for them people to blitz through. Yeah. And you don't need to protect anyone at low TV. Obviously, once people get Chlora, Mighty Blow and Block and everything, it changes. Um... My video isn't when you search for movement seven one turn, it's not there. That's a bit of a shame, isn't it? Mine 
games how to score a one turn touchdown with movement seven, but it doesn't come up if you do movement seven one turn. I don't get that. But there you go. There's there's the movement seven one, which is uh, which is you know obviously that's a bit a bit more than than you would normally need. But yeah, I was thinking of doing like movement nine one turn, movement eight one turn, and movement seven, and move, even movement six one turn. Uh, yeah, it's not a bad idea to do them, is it? Mm -hmm. So now we're equal men. <laughs> Nothing to show for my first half of dominance. And out bashed. Looking at a draw. Well, I've got to actually be out of this now. Are you actually a Bobby Roode fan? Of course I am. Yeah, I know I got two KOs on my drive as well. I know that. But the point is, that's tempered by him also doing it, isn't it? You know? That's what I'm saying. Although I was lucky, it, I didn't get any permanent ones. So, it's like, it's just frustrating, isn't it? When you get that level of dominance, yet have nothing to show for it. At, at, in the second half is it just a bit frustrating that's all you would have thought with all of that with all those blocks that I generated the surf having two men up all half you'd have thought I would have uh, I could have you know made it made a cas to uh, make it easier not that I was you know skillful to get the removal so it's not like I deserve it it's not like I played great to get the removals, so I deserve to have an advantage in the second half. It would have just been nice to have done. Now we're just playing as if I just had a normal drive and nothing extraordinary happened. We've got an extra block out there and a push. I didn't hate that. Well, it depends. It depends, uh, KLZ, doesn't it? Sometimes it's right. Like, low TV, you absolutely want to use it to win the drive or the game. Because your players don't have any skills or anything. If you've got a claw pawn, then, you know, if you don't save him, then you're going to lose lots of subsequent games because of it. So, it's not really cut and dry. <laughs> Go there after all that. Maybe I don't know Kelly's. Maybe yeah. Maybe that's how it works. No, there's nothing weird about getting a bash, but I mean, uh, it's e even bashing. It's just that as lucky as that first half was, I've got nothing to show for it. That's all. That's all I was. That's all I was saying.
because it was my drive, so I would expect to score. So like, if 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 he had had that look on his drive, I would have turned him over and scored, and I would have been one 0 up receiving. So that's all I was saying. Really, that that good luck wasn't really. You know, it was good luck. You know, I'm not underestimating how lucky it was. It's just that it hasn't translated to the second half. Throwing it. What the fuck? Let's him to get an extra hit. He's thinking, isn't he? Rocking his brains. Just got early and tried to turn him off. Can't with chaos, can you? Making <laughs> it doesn't mean you're all good dice, that's the most important thing. Boom, skull, get out of town. It was good strength four, it was good application of strength four, though, wasn't it? He had to use three players there just to get a one dice block. Now, of course, he could have just moved an extra guy in and made it two, but he's moved him there anyway. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, that was terrible of him to have uh, made it a one dice there. But still, that was like five players there to knock to block two guys. I 
I was really bad that he didn't move him in first. Wasn't it? Back to dum dum chaos. No, they're they're positively fantastic chaos. I'm gonna try to play well and stay positive. So was my cock. Exactly. Genius tactician chaos. Yep. That's what they are. And here we have one, two, three, four, five. The lesser spotted. Hope they base, base, base. <laughs> Generating extra blocks, glorious. <laughs> um, no squirrel, dude. <laughs> to put it, to put it bluntly, no. <laughs> He might, he's gonna go this way. There's no, there's no way to go forward. You have to one dice here and then one dice here or something. Can't go there. You can block there to to get this. So this has to be here. I just in there as well. Two on his old is a bit shit, but now he's gonna come back this way and hopefully I haven't committed too much. Not bad. Not bad. That is it from Kanar. Not a bad record. <laughs> He's like me on the chops. <laughs> oh dear, like me on the chops. I mean, that's about what I'd expect. You know, he's he's better than he's better than the average cold player. Wow, I just up, uphill, just uphill blitz and get a double power, mate. Don't, no worries. I didn't expect that. I thought he'd have. I thought he'd have moved around this side. I didn't think he'd try to, uh, or at least make it a one dice from him, not not an uphill blitz. Yeah, but he played on fumble, didn't he? He was all right on fumble. Like he's not bad. He's not bad at blood bowl, is he? I just don't think he's. You know, as good as me. <laughs> you know, or Lupac or whatever. I've got some good chain plays here next turn now to recover potentially. No, true, true. I wasn't I wasn't putting Lou back on a pedestal or anything. Don't worry. <laughs> I'd expect, I'd expect, I'd expect Kanawha to have a winning record in champs, to be fair. Yeah, but also Necropotence, his games don't matter at all, you know. Um, if I was to be playing games that didn't matter a flying fuck, <laughs> I would also be, a, I would be a lot less salty, wouldn't I? Um... Right, a GFI in here, block him there, block him, block him, chain, surf, right. 
Okay. So he just has to block. He could block him. No, he might as well block him. One, two, three, four, five. No, he blocks him. Yeah, because the push pushes in the same square anyway. Oh, great. That's how. That's how you start the fucking turn. Two chances to power. Now it's a double GFI to go there. Maybe I changed the plan, eh? Fuck. That was unlucky. I guess I have to change the plan. That was very disappointing. I can't risk two GFIs without a reroll. As sexy as it would be to, to chain him there and then block him there and then block him and then, you know... GFI to serve, although that would be amazing. I can't risk all those dice rolls now without a reroll. There you go, double score, brilliant. Yeah. Yeah, the tactical chain was, there was some, a real possibility to serve his ball carrier there, but after I'd after I'd used a reroll and only got two pushes, I couldn't even try it, could I? As the as Le Double schools proved. Gonna draw this game now. Nothing I can do. <laughs> oh well. That's low chaos, isn't it? It's even high chaos sometimes as well. Yeah, that's the thing. I mean, if... if Yeah, exactly. Yeah, Squirrel Dude. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> um, but one could argue he got lucky with the dice rolls to uh, to even get that far. With humans, um, but yeah, that that's the thing, isn't it? With Kanor is basically as as Grindel says that he plays for no stakes. At the end of the day, it's uh, if I was just playing, not trying to qualify. Like if I was playing in open, um, I'd still want to win. Actually, <laughs> I would still want to win. But if I was playing in open on my own league, then. Where nothing really mattered, then it'd be then I would be a lot less salty, wouldn't I? But when you're playing champs ladder and you're trying to qualify for champs ladder, you know it's inhuman not to not to be salty. And, and Sage is the same. Sage plays champs ladder and he knows he can't qualify because he doesn't play enough games. So there's no reason for Sage to be to be salty either. Yeah, true squirrel dude. But do you know what I mean though? If I was happy with playing in open. <laughs> if I was happy with playing in open. Or in Mr. Hardwick's invitation or whatever. Can't believe that I had two chances to power him. And uh, just failed. Right, chance of a power and then a chance of a dodge. Could happen. No power. Push him for the two turn attempt. Fuck it. Out bashed. And again, not unreasonable. I've got a lot of armor rate and he's got 
a mighty blown four block. Let's do. <laughs> the Dark Elves went amazing, Kales, Eddie. <laughs> that was a win due to him forgetting about the ball completely. He, could, he, could, he would have just won, but he just didn't pick up the ball. <laughs> uh, one, two, three, four, five. He's just let me get extra scoring threats. That's nice of him. One, two, three, four, five, six. So the first thing is he goes one, two, three, four, five, six as a scoring threat. And... He's also put these one on one against Warriors. These can do things. Warrior could go for the pass, but it's probably not the time to do that, is it? Crossbow man's got to make got to make a good throw, hasn't he? One, two, three, four, five, six, and then he blitzes. He blocks. One, two, three, four, five. He stands in there. He goes around. He goes around. Yeah, there's there's chances here. It'd have been awesome though to have done the pass with the warrior, wouldn't it? The warrior on five. It would have really been incredibly greedy, though. Oh, man. Glorious quick snap. Absolutely glorious. Now they're all in scoring range. Um, without GFIs. That gets into there, which is an even better place to stand, isn't it? So he can power and he can power, so there's a line of men. He wants to go there effectively and double GFI to hand off to him who then goes like here or something stands here and this is a good place to stand isn't it Could go there and then go on the sideline there. One, two, three, four, five, six, GFI. That's probably the play, isn't it? That's probably the play there. To put him there. And him there. Make these blocks last. Glorious. There you go, shield man. Good 
probably should have actually maybe should roll that and then got the dot to the tag of the ogre. I really don't want the ogre in, do I? At least now he's got to get rid of him before the ogre does anything. Did it all without a reroll? Outrageous. This guy should have uh, gone to here, shouldn't he? So there was a screen in front. That was where I went wrong. Or this, the warrior that hit here should have gone one, two, three, four, five GFI, something like that. But yeah, it was a, it was a great, it was a great quick snap, wasn't it? The quick snap was amazing to get everyone, everyone in the much better positions. It would have been horrible having to make three GFIs and not being able to do them first and stuff. Maybe he should have GFI'd to here and then he could have been there or something. Or not moved him and then GFI'd out two at the end. If he'd gone there and he'd... Nah, but this guy's here. Probably could have done it better. I mean, I know I could have done it better. Yeah, the quick snap was pretty nice. I can just double screen, but I can always pass it to the other one. The fact that I don't have to blitz the carrier free here is good, isn't it? No matter what happens now. Okay, so doing okay, which goat? Um, won the first game, and then this is the second one. Which, you know, even if it's a draw, it's alright, isn't it? He, no, it's not going to be a loss. Double GFI to 3 plus pass. This is a GFI at 2D. Ah, but then that blocks the route. For his blitz, it might just have to be a, a 1D. Oh, he's getting the... Oh, the Augus failed! <laughs> so a 3 plus, and then a 2D, and then a GFI. Oh, unless he does that. So now it's a blitz on him. Blitz on him. He double GFIs, passes to him. I'm pretty sure. I could just blitz here and hope to power him, but that doesn't seem like a good idea, does it? I think blitz him. Actually, you could just block him. You could just block him. And blitz him to there. He can block him, try to power him. And one, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI, pass, catch, score. And I guess I could just 2D him, 1D blitz, that's probably going to be the best, hasn't it? <laughs> it only adds a 2, it doesn't even make it harder, it just means that I've got to do it with a ball carry. In fact, I don't even need to do that, do I? It's just a one dice here, that doesn't mean anything. Yeah, so it just means I've got to do it with a ball carrier. It didn't actually change anything, it just looked like it did. It's an extra GFI though, isn't it? Because I can't power him here. I can't follow the power. 
So it is double GFI. But still better than the janky throw. Did it. Glorious. Jim Glorious Powell. <laughs> Shield man. <laughs> Sacrifice to the Yeti. <laughs> Gets the win. Ogre MVP. <laughs> Too, didn't he? He just absolutely fucking had to. Oh my god. Bonehead. 50 50 on the boneheads. Andy roll the double skull. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh my god. Right. Um, so yeah, don't want to buy anybody. Um, no skills, but all of the uh, all of the warriors are um, a touchdown. In his case, or a Kaz, or a completion, or an MVP away from leveling. So it's good SPPs after two games, even though the lack of a block is disturbing. Um, right, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.